Ring of Pain. All right, I've been playing so much of this game and getting my butt kicked. This is just a normal run. Really strong start. We're next to a chest and a stat up. Okay, we got this. What do you got for me? This one's decent. I could just take this or I can re-roll and look for broken things. Re-roll and look for broken things. Teleport to exit. Clarity doesn't do much for me, but you know what? I have lots of open slots. Why not? Defense kind of does more for me early, but I need to get speed up at some point. So last thing I need is this chest. Toss up on if I kill it before it attacks me. Good job. Patience. Patience is rough. What do you got? Um, three attack and one speed is not bad at all. It's that or else look for a broken item. I do get two rerolls, so I could look at four more items. Let's look. These are not it. Let's look again. Bandana's decent. It's not amazing. It's not what I was looking for. That's just a normal exit. I think patience probably destroys me, but it's an extra floor and it does have rewards if I can get to them. Getting to them, a little bit tricky. Hey, that was a good stealth. Soul attacks deal plus three damage. I don't know exactly what that means. I kind of just want to re-roll this, but I can't afford to. Okay. Freeze front cards. Or take pierce. Give me the pierce. So it does look like I'm getting out of here for free. Bam. Barely. I would have liked to get this other stat, but that's not... Not a possibility. All right. Finders keepers. Yeah, I'll take that. Mushrooms plus one health three times when I exit the dungeon. Hopefully I find a better jar. Look at that. We already got plus one. The exploder worries me a little bit. I need room to run from it. Oh, I should have tried to get more souls first. Chest plate, eh. Reroll. Misting Vessel. Okay. We have a way to win. Misting Vessel is amazing. Plus 10 stealth for each empty inventory slot. So now I can have clarity plus stealth for empty inventory slots. Cool. So I can sneak by everything. We're looking for only good stuff. Only good stuff. This one is kind of good. I don't think it's good enough. Plus one petrify on attack. Would have been nice with that other item that wanted to get petrify kills. Um, plus two healing from potions. Nope, discard both. Because I have guaranteed stealths, I'm being very picky about stuff that I do. Or stuff that I take. I do have a potion right there. That was one of my crits. Reprieve. How do I get out of here? Where are we? 
And in between not here nor there, ascension awaits. This won't compare. Cool. Okay, exploder. Exploder's good. Well, except for that thing. It's okay. I don't really want... Hmm. That's fine. Oh, I can fight... No, I can't fight that one. What is your speed? Speed is 10. Mine is only 7. There's a jar up. Okay. I'm looking for a better jar, but... I'll take that regardless. Failed curse. Can't afford this. So now my max HP will go up. I do have crits available right now. I think I can handle ambush. I need to fight the tough one first. This isn't really the tough one. Still not the tough one. Okay, I guess that's it. I thought some tough enemy spawned. Skip past creature after attack. Skip past creature after attack. I don't know exactly what this means. It might mess with me. I'm gonna take it to try it. Oil is good. I can't afford it. Plus one poison on attack. I can afford it. Yes. Let's go. Okay, so I do have to watch out for my stealth at some point. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. That's how many slots I need. Seven, eight. So I have two extra slots right now. And what did I get that was helpful? Poison on attack. Skip past creature after attack. I don't know what that means still. Plus 5% stealth chance. Kind of interesting. Random exit is nice. I do want to kill that. Before it gets away. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. I'm not going to be able to. Mistakes were made. Wait, it's still there. Barely got it. Twenty percent chance to skip past. I don't really want this item. If it was guaranteed, at least I could figure out what it's doing. But I don't know what it's doing. Still at a hundred percent. That was questionable to take that, but. Position to strike. Volatile. So this is going to have lots of exploders. I think position to strike is better. Oh no, it's got a whole bunch of ranged enemies. No, it doesn't. Okay. Well, at least it doesn't have ranged enemies. Shuffle dungeon when an explosive creature dies. 
every four attacks freeze creature. Let's make sure. So this one gives 5%. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I can take this, but then I can't take any others. Okay. I can't even kill this? did kill it. So I'm just trying to get up my freeze charge. Freeze charge is up. With that freeze charge... There's not much to do. Okay. Not a very good floor. I need to get rid of some of these items. At least it was a free floor, so it didn't really matter. Exploder, this thing. I want this exploder to hit this. There's another exploder. It's not really doing what I wanted, but that's okay. Kind of hoping that thing would end up next to something that helped me. Could get the strike dummy just to charge up my gloves. Ooh, wishful. Okay. Now we're talking. Timeless. Way to turn. Way to turn is interesting. Does that mean that I want to check this blue chat? I can't. Can't afford to. Okay. Wishful. Let's go. All right. So now, the vessel's the only one that has to stay. This should stay. This one's decent. This one can go. Bandana can go. So these first two can go. The empty jar could go, but I don't gain anything from that. I want this one to go. Opal's not bad to get rid of. Okay. I want this one gone just because I don't understand it. I think I get rid of one of these two and then I get rid of the opal because the opal's worth more when I have less things in the slots. 5% stealth. Bonus from speed, 7%. That 5% does actually make a difference. Okay. So now I can take way more items. What do I need? Speed or attack? Not sure yet. Okay, that's a lot of exploders and ranged enemies. My freeze gloves are ready. I don't really want to use them on this, but whatever. Ranged units are such a pain. At least I have a big heal. I can definitely take this. Hmm. So which of you is worth more? You're worth five. You're worth five. 
speed or damage? Speed up. How much are you worth? You're worth six. I could use the freeze tree. Might as well. I could fight this thing. Three speed. 10% crit chance. This one's not bad. Okay. Because I already had a jar, why not? And it triggers right away. Okay, this is good. You're a pain. It's going towards me. I kind of want to see what this stat is. You really are a pain. Why did I get to attack twice? I didn't understand how that enemy worked. Now I think I do. Crossroads is good. I want to see that door. Oh yeah, I get to stealth for free. It's just an owl. Okay, we're gonna go to Crossroads, but there are good jars that I could get from this. There's other good items too. Um, nah. Plus three souls on kill. Let's re-roll again. Reroll again. I'm really looking for that jar. Not this jar. Last reroll. I could take the socks. Or I could take this one. Hmm. Give me the socks. I feel like there aren't that many good feet, anyways. Aggression. Or a careful maneuver. Aggression sounds alright. My damage isn't that high, but I can sneak past everything. Let's just shuffle. Why do you... Oh, it's a toss-up. My speed is not high enough. Okay. Attacks also deal half damage to the creature behind, and it ups my speed. Let's do it. Kind of cool. You're going to attack your friend. Let's shuffle. Maybe I could have ended up next to that and that would have messed with me. I'm not sure. This is my freeze attack. I can actually get this thing to kill the enemies for me. I don't know how much this really helps, but every little bit in this game seems important. What do you got for me? Evolve random other creature on attack. 60% chance. Um... It scares me. Evolve sounds scary. That thing is scary. There's no enemies near it right now. I think I just need to run towards it. Easy game. 
Banish? I don't remember what that one is. I could always take the full heal if I need to. I have plenty of open spots that I'm allowed to take. Damage or speed? Let's go with speed. Kind of questionable, but all right, I can almost kill this thing. You're moving towards the exit. I don't mind having this wall here because this thing will move towards me. Fountain of life, I don't care about freezing you is fine. Oh, I did not freeze you. Okay, now my freeze is ready. That's a lot of ranged units. The exploder's heading towards me. I don't really want to take a damaging one before... Am I taking the Fountain of Life or just the normal door? Just the normal door. Okay. Damage up. My speed's already very high. There is another heal. I could go fight this one. Nah. Gain souls for exploded damage taken. Inflict freeze on parry. Hmm. Oh, this gets rid of that. So no. Non. It's not an option. Okay, Hex. Hex is kind of good. Right now I have my freeze up. I can just use the freeze. That rapier, rapier, rapier. Yeah, it's kind of cool. I like it. I think I should be good just to go... Oh, right, a wall would actually block me. Good to get the explosion damage onto this. I kind of want to go to the right and hit through this thing into you. I could just hex this, actually. I'm going to do that. That enemy is a pain. I don't really want to use my freeze up on that. Bronze Leaf. 10% dodge, 10% crit. Okay. 14% from my speed. So I have 50% default. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I have one more slot still. Hmm. This thing's a pain. Let's kill it. So my freeze will be ready again. Oh, right. I have parry, er, rapier. Let's go. Could have used purple, but we're looking for yellow. 
Why did you send these creatures? In the halls of twisted thought, you walk amongst the things you've wrought. Are you saying I did this? Sculptor. Creatures killed by petrify add three petrify to neighbors. Kind of cool. What? What? Those enemies are a pain. If I do this, you'll still be to my right. No, I think I have to move this way. Good stuff. This one can't be frozen. This is a scary enemy, kind of. These are very scary when they're attacking. You're good for me to attack the thing behind you. Yeah, Rapier's really good. This would use up my freeze. I can't use freeze on this anyways, so I might as well. There's a ranged unit. So much speed. This thing's a pain unless I have freeze ready. considered it onwards starting right next to this big ranged unit is nice there's a lot of exploders right now crap they're poison exploders um where's a potion there's no potion I have to make it to this door can't make it to the door. I just lost again. Yet again. Do you have something that gets rid of poison for me? Ranged creatures won't attack you is the item that I want. But I need something that eats poison. Immune to intimidate. Reduce current health to one. Gain five attack after completing three dungeons. Nope. Targeted spells inflict six petrify to target creature. What? Heal three on attack when below 25% health. And it gives three max HP. Wait, this would take me to nine. I think I could live with this. 50% chance to heal. Okay. Pretty lucky. I could get a gold chest. Kill that. My freeze charge is ready. Explosive. Deal 20 damage to target and 10 to each adjacent creature. Reduce piercing damage taken by 1. This would actually reduce my stealth. Okay, good to know. Taking a gold chest is questionable because of that, but I could find something that replaces something else. Guaranteed stealth when passing poisoned creatures. Can't take it. Heal five on crit. 20% crit chance. One, two, three, four. Five. Yeah, I can't take it. Reroll for 20. Unequip for every negative point of clarity. 
This item gains one stat to random other stats. Deal soul gain as random soul damage. Er, yeah, soul damage to damaged creatures. Okay. Can I take Reckless? Do I need to take Reckless? I don't think I need to. I could take this. I don't think I need to. Remove all poison from self and apply that amount to target. Failing stealth gives you guaranteed stealth next pass. Just give me a little bit of health. Spend all souls for every 30 souls. Gain plus one to random stat. This thing. It's not that bad, but a little bit bad. You're running for the door, which is right there. I kind of want this stat up. Okay. That changes things a little. It's about to absorb a creature. Plus, that's a cursed stat up. Okay, kill it before it gets to absorb too much. I could freeze this. God, I want to take this, use it. That kind of makes sense to me. What is this thing? Oh, it's another amalgam. At least it's heading towards me, but I don't know what it's going through. Okay, that wasn't bad. I kind of want to use the freeze on something better than this, but whatever. You're going to blow yourself up. Good stuff. Okay, I don't have a freeze attack ready. Darkened Blade. The soul gain bonus from killing is boosted by negative clarity instead of positive. Kind of cool, but not like amazing. And it gets rid of my rapier, which is amazing. This could get me into trouble though at some point. This is when you're vulnerable and I still can't hit. Okay. Would I give up all of my souls for two random stats? I don't think so. Hey, we've done it. Right, you steal souls. Get away from that thing. Volatile. I think I can handle volatile. I say that, but who knows. Okay, there are exploders. They're moving towards me. You're gonna split. Splitting is good. I do random damage. Deal soul gain as random soul damage to damaged creatures. You're gonna explode. Kinda cool. I need ways to damage the other creatures. This is my freeze attack. Soul craft. Soul craft is good. Ensnare on attack. Excess killing damage becomes soul damage to a random creature. Ooh. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. I might get rid of this one. 
I could get rid of the rainbow socks. Rainbow socks or the chrysalis heart. So now I'm still at 100% stealth. 92. Okay. Let's get rid of that one. Okay. 100% stealth. I can still get one more item. I could get a gold item right now. That would be a little bit questionable. But I could do it. Let's go heal. I feel really good about this run. I'm close to the end. Ah, <sighs> There's still a bunch of things I can't really fight though. But I can get past them, which is the main thing. A main thing? Do I care more about killing this exploder or this thing? I think this thing. I didn't end up doing what I wanted. You're gonna hit a wall. That was a good explosion. Good. Go! Oh, what am I doing? Random damaged. Why was it damaged? I don't know. That was my frozen attack. This thing would be good to kill. If I had a frozen attack. This thing is a pain. 28 defense. But if it was hurt, I could blow it up. I can't sneak past you. I can sneak past the others, but they'll start stealing my souls. There's a door here. There's a door here. So now, if I attack, the, it still doesn't do much. What is going on there? Not sure. Okay. I want to see this gold item. Goblet, transform on... I can't take that. Stop scroungers from fleeing. Scroungers drop plus one card. Ooh. I could re-roll this, or I could take this. I think it's too late to care much about the scroungers. Heal five on crit. Your next attack after dodging is guaranteed crit, and this gives dodge chance. Dodge chance sounds pretty nice. Or I can keep re-rolling. Precision. 70% crit chance. Healing effects restore double the amount. 70% crit. Okay. So now I have a 77% chance to crit. Not sure if that was going to kill those. Doesn't look like it did. Oh, there's a ranged unit there. Of course there is. Kill the ranged unit. Hey, we also killed that. I have to be careful about random things exploding. Shrine of Sacrifice. I think I give HP and it offers me a gold item. Half damage from melee attacks in place of 5% stealth chance. Bonus from items, 85%. Um, I wouldn't be at 100% anymore if I took that. This stupid thing does have some of my souls, but there's not much I can do about that. I don't think it's worth going to get that heal, is it? Maybe it is. Yeah, it is. Okay. Let's go check this out. Plus... 
bad compared to this one. Discard. Seventy percent crit or intimidate forty percent. <laughs> so this would give me more speed. Okay, last one. Ooh, that would be kind of nice. It's better when I have the freeze. If I can freeze enemies, then it's nice to just keep hitting them. I can't really take this. Discard. Okay, I just gave up all my HP. And we're getting to the end floor. Getting close to it. This is actually pretty scary. 28. Um. I can't stealth past this wall. I think I have to let this thing get next to me. Think. Okay, I have a good chance of critting. I attack faster. If I go to the left, it still gets to attack. I need to crit. Crit hit. That was dumb luck. I mean, I did have a good crit chance, but still. Dumb luck. You're heading to the door. That ranged unit scares me. There's two walls here. Crap. Crap. Ranged units just destroy me. I did have a heal, which helps. I can move to the right, take the defense or the max HP. The defense doesn't help me. The max HP does a little bit. If I move to the left twice, I think I get to fight this thing. Ah, uh, before I took that healing potion, I should have tried this cursed one. I have a bunch of souls. This one's tough. Exploder. I don't have any max clarity to summon frogs. Right. Okay, let's spend some money. Some souls. Dual wield. Target both front cards on attack. Yes. Skip undamaged creatures on attack. I don't know exactly what this means. I think this is what I'm taking. God, it destroys like everything because of the parries and the... I don't even know what's going on with this right now. I think max HP might be more valuable than this, but it's hard to say. It's probably not hard to say. This probably isn't worth it. Ah, maybe it is. Question mark. Light and shadow. You need me more than you admit. Balance comes with equal split. Come on. We got this. Soul Claw. After spell use, deal five soul damage to front cards. Okay, heal is good. This thing's a pain. There's an enemy moving towards me. I have to look out for amalgams. There's a lot. Before I take this heal, I need to worry about these. Yeah, so that I have room to run. So 
So these are a way for me to kind of skip turns, which is nice. Attacks always critical hit on frozen creatures. When you're vulnerable, what does this look like? Still not good. Okay. I just wanted to check. Okay. Devolve all creatures in this dungeon. Let's try that. Oh! Okay. I didn't know I was going to keep getting hit by ranged, though. And now I'm at 95% stealth. I'm getting hit by double ranged. Okay. That helped. Actually. Ten health. I'm only missing nine. Let's just take it right now. Kind of forgot that I hit both front ones. I'm going to try to fight the owl, but I don't feel good about it. Okay. Maybe I could fight the darkness thing, but I feel like the darkness thing has more ranged enemies. Douse the flame, let shadow rain. After all, you choose defiance. Why would you break our alliance? All right, let's do this. Betrayal's cost is far from free. Shown yourself, now you'll see me. Okay, we got this. We totally got this. Big Owl. This is scary. I'd like to devolve all of these now. Okay, so you're a pain to hit. You're spiky, you're ranged. I see an exploder. You're coming towards me from the left. I have good crit chance, good dodge chance, perfect stealth chance. And if I hit through things, I got rid of my freeze. Target both. Hmm. That target both might mess with me a bit. The ranged unit scares me. I don't see any walls. This is scary. Yeah, because of that. I can run away, but that ranged unit can hit me. I have to take out this ranged unit. I think this is a way for me to hit that. It is. 457 out of 500. God, I'm doing good damage to the owl. 397. Really good damage. Taking this is a little bit questionable, but let's do it. I have lots of souls. I could take this. Let's see what's in here. Item gains plus one to each primary stat for each empty inventory slot. Eh. Move away from creature on attack. What? Wait, wait, wait. Is that really good? I'm not sure if that's really good or not. I'm going to re-roll it, but maybe that is really good. I just don't no, and I don't feel like this is the time to figure it out. Passing a creature moves you to the nearest non-creature card in that direction. This gives more dodge chance. Plus temporary defense when hit until you next move. 
God, so you just never move. I'm going to try this one, but it scares me. So now when I pass, it's going to take me to this potion. Yes, it did. So when I pass this... Hmm. I'm undecided on how I feel about this. So now I have to leave items so that I can, like, teleport to them. So if I went to the left, I would go all the way to over here. Is that right? Wait. Stealth something. I don't know what just happened. No, maybe it was because I just passed this instead of an actual creature. That makes sense. Okay, so I want you to be vulnerable. I don't think I can actually hit this thing. I regret taking the one that makes me skip past a whole... Oh, there's a wall here. Oh, but I can skip walls, apparently. This thing I could hit, but I can't get to it. Because I'll skip past everything. Explosions are going to go off like crazy, too. You're moving towards me. Actually, that's pretty good. What are you doing? You're stunned. Critical hit. Two fifty. You summon a bunch of stuff. God, there's so much explodey stuff. Ah, <sighs> things got powered up. Okay, I don't see any ranged units. Because of crits, I would be killing a lot more of these things than it's, like, showing. This explodes and hits that. Random things get damaged, too. Okay, I have to move out of this spot. That's cool. I can do that. This wall... No. Maybe I should be leaving some of these alive. I'm not sure. I probably should. Because they are the things that can damage the owl. Like, leave these alive, maybe? What are you doing? Next action. Scream attack is just this again. It might keep doing this until I destroy all the enemies, now that I think about it. Oh, right. I knew that. Wait, do I have to destroy these things? Okay. That kind of makes sense to me. Okay, it's back out here. I could destroy this thing. It's stunned right now. It would take me two turns to get over to it. Oh no, I go past it. Right, I knew that. Still stunned. Still stunned. Wait, is it about to die? Holy... We've done it. We've totally done it. I think I've beat the owl before, but it's been like over a year. Or I don't know how long it's been. It feels like it's been a long time. Maybe it was more recent than that. 
Bottom line, we did it. What will you do now? Sharpen you with self-awareness, brace to face the world's unfairness. Owl is gone, but cannot die, waiting, watching, keep inside. Ring of pain. Skip. Good stuff. Deep within the ring of pain, the cycle is complete again. Show score. 51 minutes, 46 seconds. Turns taken, 646. Killed a bunch of creatures. Bunch of souls collected. Depth reached. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Back to the menu. So now, I've beaten the owl on normal and medium with dark stone. I have not beaten the other thing, the darkness. I haven't beaten any of them with this one. All item primary, all items primary stats are converted to defense except health. What? That sounds very interesting. Rerolled items have a chance to be higher rarity. Reroll costs health. Interesting. Plus 20 stealth chance. Plus 40 stealth chance minus 2 speed. So I've only won three times. And they've all been where I kill the owl. I've never beaten the darkness yet. And who knows, there still might be other starting items that you can have beyond these. Okay, for now, that does it for this video. Thanks for watching.